Hi guys, this is FT for Sage5.tv once more back with another video and today we are going to bring you the Pokedex updates, the latest updates from Pokedex. The much touted Pokedex order book is imminent. Welcome to another Pokedex update, this time on the cast of Pokedex mainnet's launch as per the latest Pokedex team updates. If you are new guys, thank you very much for dropping by and while you are here, don't forget to click like and subscribe as well as smash that notification bell. If you are a returning viewer and a subscriber, thank you very much guys i appreciate your support you are the guys who are making this channel grow so i appreciate that thank you in advance this is obviously not financial advice if you require financial advice guys you know what to do please contact someone who is trying to give you financial advice so we are going to try and keep it brief this is a quick update on pokedex and if this is your first time coming across pokedex order book here is a brief summary of what we've covered before if you want to know more by the way please check the links down below we've got a dyo a risk evaluation video we did on Pokedex as well as an update video so check the links down below and whilst you're down there guys don't forget to smash that like button as well if you're not subscribed what are you waiting for join the team we are going to win <laughs> anyway so Pokedex order book is a non-custodial peer-to-peer trading platform that manages the benefits of both centralized and decentralized exchanges in one product it is hosted on Polkadot a layer zero protocol Pokedex uses the substrate abstraction layer for SGX technology to build a decentralized exchange and one of the first use cases for this technology in general. The architecture of Pokedex order book is unique because it is a combination of multiple technologies. You've got the blockchain, parachain, trusted execution environment or TEE, IPFS or interplanetary filing system. The Pokedex order book is the flagship product within the Pokedex ecosystem. You've got the Pokedex order book and you also got the Poker IDO which is their launchpad for new products to launch on. Here are some of the key benefits for Polkadex. Polkadex order book allows traders to register multiple hot wallets on chain. Using Polkadex order book, traders can delegate their assets to a third party. So you can actually delegate your asset to someone to do the trading for you if that's what you desire. Polkadex order book also allows institutions to execute bulk buying and bulk sell orders. Traders can leave their assets on the exchange without worrying that the exchange might be hacked. Polkadex order book will also support all the favorite community trading boards so there will be integrating trading bots as well which is what most institutions will require they don't want to do what we retail investors or traders do You're watching the charts all the time they just deploy their bots and the bots will do the trading for them now now on to the updates starting with the ledger support for Polkadex if you hold the PDEX token and you want to retain absolute safety and you have some cash to spend then this could be for you this is the ledger hardware wallet by the way I understand that this will also support staking and I believe that is brilliant that's a from our point of view if you can stake from a hardware wallet that's brilliant there are other cryptocurrencies that are already doing so so it's not new but if Polkadex are going to do this i think that's brilliant of all crypto wallets out there hardware wallets are some of the safest methods to store your crypto now that Polkadex is supported head over to ledger and acquire on ledger nano s or nano s plus or the nano x all depending upon your budget of course this again guys is not financial advice do your own research to see if the ledger is the right hardware wallet for you or you want to try the trezor there are so many others so i'll try and leave some links down below for you guys to do your own research okay to learn more about wallets in general do head over to one of our previous videos where we covered both hardware wallets and hot wallets link in the description again if you go down there please don't forget to click like and subscribe as well as smash that notification bell. there are numerous resources from ledger themselves as well as on youtube on how to safely set up your wallet guys I urge you just don't get scammed Okay, make sure the when you order it and the packaging of your hardware wallet is tampered with, don't use it. It's probably because someone has got your seed phrase. So you do not want that. Or if that is the case, you may want to maybe reset it. But if it's tampered with, I will urge you not to use it at all. Just return it and they will send in a replacement. Now onto the main update, the imminent launch of the Polkadex order book on mainnet. A lot of people have been waiting, patiently awaiting for this. And I just hope the launch outlive the hype that has followed Polkadex over the past few months and weeks to date. There's been plenty of hype so we just hope it will deliver past the hype we don't want it to be another by the rumor sell the news event anyway the latest version of pokedex network is now available in version v4.0.0 and it contains the order book palette which heralds the initial steps of the upcoming mainnet release of the order book with version 4.0 the pokedex mainnet will also remove the validator set limit so validators exchanges and ecosystems will be required to upgrade their nodes within one week in order to allow the 
team to trigger a runtime upgrade, which is a unique Polkadot method of initiating network upgrades with minimal interruption. The upcoming version v4.0 does not require a complete node to be built from scratch, as most validators will only need to replace the current binary with a new one, which means nodes will be offline for very short periods of time. So again, for convenience, I think that should help. The team has also provided the five crucial steps to follow during the upgrade process. You got the download option where you download v4.0.0 .0 release, then you unzip the binary, then you stop the service file, and they give you instructions on how to do that. You replace old Polkadex node binary with the new one, restart the service file, and there are instructions for doing that. The v4.0.0 .0 prepares the Polkadex network for the mainnet release of the Polkadex order book. Once enough validator nodes have updated the latest binary, the Polkadex team will trigger the runtime upgrade, which will update the blockchain with all the requirements it needs to run Polkadex order book. The only problem I've got is we have not been informed on what's enough. What's enough validators? What does that mean? Enough validators? Maybe the information is somewhere out there. If there's a percentage or a number out there, guys, please let us know down below. You can go to the comments and tell us. Anyway, that just about wraps up the latest Polkadex updates. As far as the price is concerned, guys, be careful. Be careful out there. Remember, buy low and sell high. I know it's easy to say, right? But to actually practice it, it's not that easy. Always wait for any huge uptrends in price to cool off just before jumping in. If you fall more, guys, you are likely to suffer in the short term. In the long term, we know Polkadex. If it delivers on what it promises, it's going to smash all these prices we're currently witnessing. And it will, I believe it will also smash its previous all-time high. Again, that is just my own opinion, guys. This is not financial advice. So questions for you guys. Have you been loading up on the Polkadex PDEX token in recent weeks when the price has collapsed to below $1.20? I think now it's hovering around or above $1.40 somewhere thereabouts or did you sell because you were scared comment down below and let us know it is always worth noting that while prices could still go down from here it is also my belief that we are a lot closer to the bottom than the top not financial advice again just my own opinions guys do your own research again with these things do you also think that this will likely be another buy the rumor sell the news event again comments down below and let us know as far as we are concerned and as far as our portfolios are concerned we have not added any pdex to our 2k to 100k portfolio challenge during recent downtrends but we may or may not have made some moves as far as my private portfolio is concerned maybe that's for another time at this point just keep following us on twitter to see what other projects we are involved in what other things interest us and what moves we make from time to time i'll leave our twitter handle right here so what are your thoughts how do you feel about poker decks do you think it's got a future let us know down below guys like i said this was a quick one from your host fd for safefab.tv with your latest update on poker and this PDEX token accompanied by the latest updates. We can't wait for the mainnet, which is if things go well, we are probably talking of a matter of a few weeks. Might be longer, but we think it's a few weeks from now. What do you guys think? Comment down below and let us know. Until next time, bye for now.